we are not gonna blame this bottle of Crown Royal for this mess. It did not pick itself up off the shelf of the liquor store, all right? Unfortunately, it's involved in this mess, and it's one of the reasons why Ashley Monroe, 38 years old of Michigan, mom of four and currently pregnant with her fifth child, is sobbing. You see, they found a nearly empty pint of Crown Royal in her possession after she allegedly plowed down over 14 people. If time runs out, please go to my YouTube, The Carolina Diamond, like, comment, and subscribe. Ashley is currently sitting in jail on a $1 million bond. <sighs> Let's please first say rest in peace to Jonathan 30 and Daniel 42. They were part of that family of 14 people and they were the two that did not survive. Okay. The family was walking along the road to the grandparents home. <sighs> Everyone else is, thank goodness they're doing fine. I know this is Memorial Day weekend. Y'all, please don't drink and drive. Please do not drive under the influence. In addition to the almost empty pint of Crown Royal they found, they also found two bottles of antidepressants. Now, they located her in her vehicle because of description that was given, and they found all kind of hair and blood on the car. <sighs> please send prayers out to the families. I'm going to also send prayers out to Ashley's children, the four children that she left at home. And she's also a state employee, no less. Okay? Y'all, no one thinks that when they're drinking and driving or driving under the influence that something bad is going to happen because there is no history that, this has, that she's had any criminal record at all, which is why she was even given a bond. Okay? But... Please, this is not an accident. Accidents are you not under the influence. You are not drunk, drinking and driving. She was under the influence, allegedly. She was driving drunk, allegedly. And now two people have lost their lives and both people, excuse me, people on both sides of this lives have been changed forever.